Ang kutso. Please be seated. Ang jumlah jumlah yang telah terbung, kah mentok kita melakukan itu di saat maka lulus dalam dua ratus dua puluh satu selasa subi. Saat maka nanti ini, ang jumlah yang telah terbung, kita melakukan sedap sedai sanatan. Today, the chamber will begin to hear the closing statements from parties in case of the 002 and the 002. And before we begin the hearing, Ms. Etienne Zuhon please report the attendance of the parties and other individuals to today's proceedings. Greffier. Mr. President, for today's proceedings to hear the closing statements by parties, all parties are present. Thank you. Toutes les parties sont présentes. Thank you, Ms. Etienne Sirhuang. Le président, merci. The Chamber would like to remind the parties and the public that the Chamber scheduled to hear the closing statements in case 002 versus 002, starting from today, that is Tuesday, 13 June 2017, to 23 June 2017, as indicated in the scheduling order to hear the closing statements. That the chamber issued on the 28th April 2017. That is document E457/6. The scheduling order determines the procedures as well as the time allocations for parties to hear the closing briefs, and that information is also notified to parties by an email by the senior legal officer of the chamber on 9 June 2017. And the procedure to hear the closing statements is conducted in accordance to Rule 94 of the ECCC Internal Rules. Règle 94 du règlement intérieur des CETC. Parties filed their closing briefs. Les parties ont déposé leur mémoire finale dans le deuxième procès du dossier 002 le 2 mai 2017. As to the sequence of presenting the closing statements by party. Shall be conducted according to Rule 94.1 of the Internal Rules and according to the time allocation as follows: the co-lawyers for the party one day, co-prosecutors two days, Nunchi's defence two days, Kisapon's defence one and a half days, and the rebuttal by the lead co-lawyers for the parties and the co-prosecutors one day. And the final rebuttal of the defense teams and the final statements by the accused Nunchi and Kiyos Pon for hours. And this will be held on Friday, 23rd June 2017. After hearing the closing statements by the parties, the chamber will adjourn the proceedings. The judges will deliberate on the verdict according to Rule 96 of the ECCC Internal Rules. The chamber will notify the parties and the general public on the actual date of the announcement of the judgment in an appropriate time. The chamber also reminds the parties that in order to ensure the effective proceedings to hear the oral closing statements in case of 002 or 002, and in order to make an effective use of the time allocation for the parties, please uh, remember that uh, the Chamber uses three official languages, and for that reason you should speak slowly and articulately. 
et de manière in particulière. If a number en is mentioned, si l'on cite des chiffres, read it slowly. veuillez les lire lentement. As for the name of a person or a place, Quant please au nom pronounce de it de lieu, properly. If uh, such name is distinct. Or it is difficult si to write. Ou si ce nom est in cases where there is difficile. an exchange between a judge and a party, please wait en until the interpretation is complete before you respond. The Chamber also would like to inform the parties and the publics that this morning the Chamber instructs the security guards to bring Nunji to the courtroom. This is uh, done in accordance to the uh, recommendations made by the doctor at the ECCC who provided a certificate to the chamber this morning. And the recommendation made by the doctor is that the health condition of Nunji is that he is able to sit in the courtroom for about 20 minutes. And after the 20 minute period, uh, Mr. Nunchi, if he cannot continue to be present in the courtroom, can return to a room downstairs, uh, but please make a request to the chamber. Après une demande du and before à la I hand the floor to the uh, party to present the their closing parties, statements, the chamber would like to reiterate that the party so adhere strictly to the guidelines se conforme, se on the closing statements in case 002 slash 002, which was issued on 7 June 2017. That is document E457-7. Document numéro E457-7. And in order to make an effective use of that uh, guideline, pour, uh, as well as for the interest of the general public, who are following the trial, I will read in full the uh, guideline as follows. One, with a view to ensuring the smooth conduct of closing statements in case 002-002, starting on 13 June 2017, the trial chamber provides the following guidelines to the parties. Witness protection, integrity of investigation in cases 003 and 004. The parties are reminded of the trial chamber's memorandum E319-35-15, dated 31st May 2017, adopting the conclusions of the International Court Investigating Judges Memorandum E319-35-14-3 of 20. 2nd May 2017. The trial chamber stresses that confidentiality restrictions continue to apply to the witnesses and documents included in Annex 3 to the trial chamber's memorandum. The parties must therefore refer to those witnesses by their pseudonyms where available or by the number of relevant written record of interviews during the closing statements. Evidence not admitted and request for reconsideration. Parties are reminded that the Chamber may base its decision only on Quelle evidence that has been put before the Chamber pursuant to Internal Rule 87.3. The trial Chamber notes that in its closing brief, the Nunji defense has requested the Chamber to reconsider its decision to not admit the material set out in Annex 1. Avoir recevable tous the les Chamber will address this request at an appropriate time. La Chambre se prononcera sur cette demande en temps opportun. During closing statements, Au cours des parties will be permitted 
on an exceptional exceptional basis and we appreciate this through the final decision to make reference to material we discussed of this request for reconsideration qui sont visés par la requête au fin de réexamen. Any party choosing to refer to such material during closing statements shall state in each instance when doing so in order that this will be clear to the other parties as well as the public. In this context, the Chamber expects the parties to focus on evidence on which they rely in their closing brief. In any case, during closing statements, en tout état de cause, au cours des réquisitions de l'Ordre 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 the Nunchi defense has requested la that the chamber reconsider a number of rejected defense witness requests and investigation requests. The chamber will address these requests at an appropriate time. Torture tainted statements. Déclaration obtenue par la torture. The Chamber recalls that according to Article 321 of the Cambodian Code of Criminal Procedure, any declaration given under physical or mental coercion shall have no evidentiary value. Further, according to Article 15 of the Convention Against Torture, any statement which is established to have been made as a result of torture shall not be invoked in any proceedings except against a person accused of torture as evidence that the statement was made. The Chamber has held that the, the torture tainted evidence cannot be used for the truth of its contents. However, objective information contained within confessions, such as the date of arrest, is not part of the statement and can be used. The same applies to annotations made on confessions by the interrogator or his superior. The Chamber recalls its finding that a real risk exists that a torture was used at S21 and at a security center to obtain confessions. Document E350-8, paragraph 79. Any party seeking to rely upon such evidence may rebut this preliminary determination in particular upon a showing of specific circumstances negating this risk. For this reason, during evidentiary hearings, the Chamber did not permit the use of confessions which were obtained at security centers including S21, absent a showing that this statement was not torture tainted. As the accused in this case are charged with the crime of torture, the chamber must ultimately apply a different and higher standard of proof in its verdict in order to determine whether torture occurred. The preliminary determination by the Chamber that there is a real risk that evidence was obtained by torture may differ from its final conclusion based on the standard for conviction on the allegations of torture, considering the totality of evidence available at the judgment phase, 
pour déterminer yes, si les évaluations de proceedings have sont établies à There un degré no suffisant pour fonder un verdict de culpabilité. Les audiences consacrées à l'examen des éléments de preuve ont été déterminées. Le risque parmi d'autres que les témoins participants soient indûment influencés par des déclarations de M. le parti torturant n'existent plus. Le Conseil de Chambre autorise les parties qui sont nécessaires à faire référence à de tels documents so. lors de leur réquisition et plaidorie finale. So, however, Toutefois, prior avant de discussing any such document that the chamber has attached presumptions that the evidence to be discussed was obtained by a torture. This shall serve to provide fair notice of the nature of the evidence discussed, absent which the parties and public could be misled. The Chamber has adopted this approach to potentially torture tainted materials in order to facilitate comprehensive and, as far as possible, an interrupted closing statement. And I'd like to hand the floor now to the political lawyers for civil parties to present their closing statements as well as the submissions on the final reparation claims. And the political lawyers for civil parties have one day time allocation. Do you have the floor? The principal for the civil parties dispose of a day to do it. You have the floor. My name is Peik Ong. I am the national lead co-lawyer for civil parties. Good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, Your Honours. Good morning, parties. Good morning, everyone in and around the courtroom, as well as the civil parties. Today, Tuesday, 13 June 2017, is a very good day for the civil parties to present our overall closing statements. That is to highlight, uh, in summary, the events and the harms that they experienced and suffered. As well as uh, to uh, present the reparation projects uh, that we have. And this is after the evidentiary hearings for over 200 days. And allow me to uh, uh, say that, that we are the lead co-lawyers and the civil party lawyers, and we represent the consolidated group of civil parties. And initially, this group consisted of 3,867 civil parties. Out of this number, 2,195 civil parties Live in Phnom Penh and the uh, nearby provinces. We also have 1,093 civil parties who live in provinces far from the city. In particular, 212 civil parties are from Kampong Tum Province and 268 are from Pusat Province. The number, the total number of uh, 3,867 civil parties does not remain the, the same. When the hearing, since the uh, trial started, we were informed that 181 civil parties passed away. And out of this number, 37 successors continue their civil party status. 34, rather. In case 002-02, 64 civil parties testified, and 63 of whom concluded their testimonies. 10 out of 64 civil parties were under 16 years old when they were under the regime that is from 75 to 79. And there were also some new people as well as best people. And 16 of them were the Khmerus at the time. As stipulated in Rule 23, the 
23 Queen Quiz or the Khmer uh, Tribunal, the Donc civil parties, first the uh, complaints against the accused, in support of the uh, co prosecutors, and second to seek uh, collective and moral reparations. Uh, Elle cherche à For today's closing statements, the lead co-lawyers will provide some highlights Dans les in relation to some civil parties who testified before this chamber, and their testimonies would assist the honours uh, to see the elements of uh, crimes uh, in those uh, charges, as well as uh, we will highlight the harms suffered by civil parties. And I myself will uh, present the closing statements on work size, as well as the uh, persecution of the German people. And Madame Thierry Lee Cham will make a presentation on Trump-Cock Cooperative, the persecution of Buddhists, and Grand Akian Security Center. Hong Kong Soon will make a presentation concerning three security centers, as well as on the topic of internal purges. And finally, the lead co-lawyer, Mary Giro, will present uh, the closing statements on the treatment of the uh, Vietnamese during the democratic uh, Kampuchea regime period, Pendant la période de Kampuchea as well as on the uh, forced uh, marriage. Ainsi que les mariages forcés. And about the final session of today's uh, proceedings, Mary Giro and myself will present the collective reparations uh, projects where the funds have been secured for the implementation. Dont les ont été, ont été obtenus en vue de leur mise en œuvre. And uh, during the presentation of the closing statement, I'd like to make a request to uh, Joanna, Mr. Uh, President. Finale, to allow us uh, vous to uh, present uh, de some video clips as well as uh, the projection of uh, some documents and uh, photographs ainsi que certains documents et which have been provided to the AV unit, so there is no need to seek permission each time that we have to present uh, such a material. Comme cela, nous n'aurons pas à demander la permission ou l'autorisation chaque fois que nous voulons faire projeter de tels documents ou Le président. Yes, uh, your request is granted. However, that La is in fait droit à votre in relation to only the documents or materials that have been presented or put before the chamber. Ou, uh, les pièces and in the cases where uh, materials uh, which have not been put before the chamber, Dans le cas où y des those pas like materials would not be uh, permitted chambre. by the chamber. La chambre N'autorisera pas but, um, uh, yes, uh, Mr. President, we will only Maître use Picard. the uh, documents that oui, have Monsieur been uh, allowed by the this chamber. Par la chambre. And I'd like now to uh, make my presentation in relation to a work site. In Keir Sampon's speech made Dans on the 15th of April 1977, during the uh, Second anniversary of the victory of 17 April 1975, Kisapon made the following speech. At all construction sites where the dams, the reservoirs, and canals are being made, many of the units have concluded their plans. And in uh, reference to children, Kisapon uh, makes the following statement Children are happy in chasing uh, sparrows in building the dams as well as uh, the uh, dam walls, in digging the reservoirs and the canals. He said, happy. Were they actually happy as uh, claimed by Kisum Paul? Is that the truth? The real situation was not as what this leader uh, stated. The statement uh, was a facade. The parties uh, 
spoke about les parties civiles the harms ont parlé and the suffering des that they received et les during the regime ont enduré sous they le régime they as slaves ont été and they were forced to overworked in a various work sites à se surmener de travail sur divers chantiers and work sites were set up throughout Cambodia before 1975. From the early stages of the CPK control over certain parts of the territory, these cooperatives and work sites continued until at least the 6th January 1979. The trial chamber is specifically seized of three work sites and one cooperative. Japan's modem work site, Kampong Chinang Airport construction site, 1st January Dam work site, and the Tramcock cooperatives. The trial chamber, the closing order that seizes the trial chamber states that one of the cooperatives in establishing cooperatives and work sites was to put the population to work in order to provide food for internal consumption and for export. President, please hold on and counsel Copper, you have the floor. Yes, Mr. President, sorry to interrupt, but my client would like to go down to this time. Thank you. 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 Yes, your request is uh, granted. La chambre l'autorise à le faire. The member would like to inform the parties and the general public that got into the medical uh, certificate made by the uh, doctor at the ECC this morning. Who notices about the health condition of uh, Nunchi that uh, he Il has a chronic uh, back pain and it becomes a severe when he sits for long. So uh, your request is granted, and the security personnel are instructed to Votre take Nunchi agent de sécurité veut conduire Nunchia to the room downstairs, dans la salle so de that he can follow the proceedings uh, remotely, and this apply uh, for the whole day. Every unit personnel are instructed to leave the proceedings to the room downstairs, la so that Nunchia can uh, follow. Pour que And uh, Council, you may resume your Maître, presentation. Vous pouvez continuer votre présentation. And work sites was to put the population to work in order to provide food for internal consumption and for export. This involved, amongst other activities, rapidly increasing the production of paddy to three tons per hectare per crop, creating a countrywide irrigation network or building infrastructure such as as fields or dams. It is alleged that another objective of the establishment of cooperatives and their work sites was to further the policy relating to detecting, defending against, re-educating and smashing the enemy to eliminate the private sphere. Thus, destroying the existing social structure and replacing it with a collectivism regime in which there was no allowance for individual or family interest. The tribunal will have first to determine whether crimes against humanity occurred in those cooperatives and working sites. And second, whether the accused can be held responsible si for those crimes. The aim of today's presentation is to show how civil party evidence can assist en quoi the trial chamber par les civiles peuvent aider in la chambre characterizing de the material elements of the various crimes for which the accused are uh, indicted. Retenu contre les accusés, Dans la décision de renvoi, be it enslavement, torture, 
la réduction en esclavage, la torture, la persécution pour motifs politiques. I will first interview civil party evidence relating to a working size. Les éléments de preuve produits par les parties civiles relativement au site de travail. 101 civil parties were admitted in the context of crimes ont été reçues en leur constitution dans le cadre de crimes commis aux barrages de trappéens.